Hi everyone, I'm Brittany Erickson and I lead Floodgate Medical's commercial talent acquisition within the urology space. I'm here to share what's new, innovative, and disrupting the urology medical device market. I just got back from attending AUA 2023 in the Windy City, Chi-Town, Chicago. It's known for its beautiful skyline, museums, the bears, the bulls, and the bean. It was my first time visiting and also my first time trying deep dish pizza. After trying it, I have to say, I might like the architecture of Chicago a little more than the pizza. This was my second time attending the American Urological Association Expo, and it was action packed to say the least. The annual meeting is in its 118th year and the largest gathering of urologists in the entire world. This event provides unparalleled access, groundbreaking research, new guidelines, and the latest advances in urologic medicine. There were 355 exhibitors and over 10,000 attendees this year. You could definitely feel the energy and the excitement from the moment I stepped into the building. The list of exhibitors included some established market leaders such as Coloplast, BK Medical, Labory, Cook Medical, Carl Stores, and Richard Wolf Instruments. I'll be sharing a few updates from some of my favorites from last year, plus introducing some newer players in the space. One of the major trends we continue to see is the focus on diagnosis of prostate cancer and the treatment of BPH. According to the American Cancer Society, one in eight men will be diagnosed with prostate cancer within their lifetime, and the likelihood increases dramatically as they age. Chances are most of us know someone who has been diagnosed with prostate cancer, which is why I'm so passionate about the impact that these amazing innovations have on these patients. Last year, I learned about a unique treatment option called the Tulsa Pro from Profound Medical. They are a fast-paced, growing organization committed to establishing a new standard in cancer care. Their transurethral ultrasound ablation technology is safe, precise, durable, and flexible to treat many disease states, whether you are treating focal or customizable whole gland. The Tulsa Pro keeps the treatment in the MRI suite versus the operating room and leads to predictable outcomes, a minimized risk of side effects, and comprehensive applications. Patients love that it's an outpatient procedure that preserves their natural functioning abilities. They are really looking forward to the new AI advancements and enhancements to achieve continuous improvement in clinical outcomes, ablation planning, treatment time reduction, workflow, ease of use, and optimization. So much to look forward to, and I can't wait to see what the future holds for Profound and all of the men who will benefit from this exciting innovation. Another less invasive treatment option comes from our friends at Clinical Laser Thermia Systems, or CLS. Their Tranberg systems are cleared and marketed in the US and Europe. Focal laser ablation provides an alternative treatment that targets and ablates only specific parts of the glands, organs, or other tissue needing treatment while preserving surrounding and remaining tissue. This generally produces faster recovery, fewer side effects, and less pain and discomfort for patients that may not always be good candidates or inoperable for traditional open surgery. Their president, Michael Magnani, is very excited to be offering physicians a turnkey solution in a mobile services platform. Next up is an update on Signati Medical with a truly remarkable way of performing vasectomies. While in Chicago, I had the honor of speaking with their CEO, Billy Prentice. He let me know that they are very close to FDA approval and finally being able to offer this groundbreaking procedure to the world. The Signati procedure is taking vasectomy to a whole new level of comfort, safety, and speed by launching the first innovation in vasectomy within the last 30 years. Their novel all outside technique can be performed in under two minutes, making the procedure simple and reproducible, reducing potential side effects and complications. Plus, the best part is that it allows for patients to get back to work and activity sooner. Signati was founded in 2018, and I'm excited to see if not but when this procedure becomes a true market disruptor. My last update is a modern and convenient way for men to analyze their fertility called Fellow. Fellow is the only peer-reviewed clinical semen analysis that patients can do from home. Their solutions include full semen analysis, post-vasectomy semen analysis, and cryopreservation. Considering so many men don't take the time or effort in a clinical setting to test their fertility, this is a game changer. Fellow's goal is to destigmatize reproductive health care and improve access to clinical insights. And they are. Fellow Senior VP of Sales, Tom Bergstrom, let me know that they have seen major growth over this past year and look forward to continuing to serve the millions of men that need access and insight to their own reproductive health. Okay, I can't wait any longer. I'm so excited to introduce a few more incredible advancements that I got to learn about for the first time at AUA in Chicago. 
First up, I'd like to tell you about a really cool customized practice management software for urology practices called Modernizing Medicine, or ModMed for short. Built by urologists for urologists. Their EHRs lay the foundation for an all-in-one suite integrated health solutions designed for multiple medical specialties. These solutions include practice management, revenue cycle management, payment processing, analytics, patient engagement tools, and much more. They have built-in urology-specific content, including suggested documentation and coding. Their simplified tracking of patient health data is designed to help spot trends, assist with chronic care management, and also have workflows that allow for the population of your analysis and lab results into the AMA with just a click of a button. ModMed is giving urologists the ability to focus on providing better patient care faster and giving patients much better experience with their physician. Next is Calixo, improving care for patients with kidney stones by delivering next generation treatment solutions. A nationwide study published in the Journal of Urology indicated that an estimated 5 million plus Americans passed a kidney stone in 2022, a number that continues with an upward trajectory. Kidney stone disease is a painful condition that brings with it staggering healthcare costs. Estimated by current urology reports to reach 4.1 billion yearly direct treatment costs by 2030. Calixo has developed an innovative CVAC aspiration system that utilizes irrigation and aspiration to remove kidney stones with the goal of surgically stone-free outcome, a challenge that has always been difficult to achieve consistently. Residual fragments left behind are associated with 20 to 44% rate of problems, including pain, infection, emergency department visits, hospitalization, and the need for retreatment, demonstrating a compelling need for innovation in this space. Can you imagine a world where patients who suffer from kidney stones don't have to anymore? Calixo can, and they have the solution for it. The exosome research field has exploded in the last decade, and exosome diagnostics has remained at the forefront of the field by developing the world's first liquid biopsy tests using exosomes. The ExoDX prostate test is a standalone exosome-based prostate cancer test delivering a unique data point to help guide the prostate biopsy decision. It is a simple urine test that leverages the power of exosomes to detect disease earlier in progression of prostate cancer. Considering the current increasing rate of prostate cancer in men, this is going to continue to be a much needed tool for patients to make life-altering decisions that will ideally improve and lengthen their life. Talk about making an impact. Last but not least, Valencia Technologies. They are a neuromodulation company transforming the standard of care for bladder dysfunction. Valencia's implantable neuromodulation technology is reshaping the delivery of long-term therapy for bladder control. Ecoin is a tibial implant for urge urinary incontinence. UUI is the most common type of bladder control problem in younger and middle-aged women. It also may begin later, around the time of menopause. The Mayo Clinic states that about 17% of women and 16% of men over the age of 18 years old have overactive bladder. An estimated 12.2 million adults have urge incontinence. The coin size neurostimulator placed under the skin near the ankle during a consistent, minimally invasive procedure using only local anesthetic, being able to bring drug-free relief to these patients is truly life-changing. I wish I had the time to highlight all of the 355 exhibitors because I met with some wonderful people on Saturday. As you can tell, there are so many transformational solutions within the urology space, and every year I continue to be so impressed with these technological advances. Please feel free to drop a comment below, share your support, or let us know which companies you found interesting at this year's AUA. See you next year in San Antonio.